please check out our shirt on Teespring. Hey folks, what's happening? What's going on? Real little curious, not too nosy. I'm going to talk about this movie you can watch on Hulu. It's kind of a twist or thriller, mystery, horror movie. And it is called Alone at Night. It came out in 2023. So I saw watch this movie on Hulu, but you can rent this on YouTube. So this movie kind of takes place in the year. There's a reality show. They're inducing the cast are going to be living in this house. The thing is, because they're endemic, they cannot leave the house. And Paris Hilton is the host of the show. And then you think this movie would be, be based on this, but it switch turns out some guy who is waiting for a day is watching this uh, program and waiting for his uh, online day to show up. And that's when you, later on, you do what kind of killer we're going to deal with during the movie. So that's kind of how the whole thing starts. But you can do this to this uh, young lady. Uh, she's going to get a ride from her friend. The plan was uh, her friend's going to take her to the cabin that her parents own. She's going to be there for seven days doing her webcam thing to make extra money during the pandemic. So you, you see what kind of things she does in front of the camera. You know, the 18 over uh, kind of like screaming service. And people pay might have her do certain things on camera, a bunch of night things what happens also I forgot that you know she's in the middle of a cab in the woods somewhere because bad things always happen never go alone or boy old cabins I guess in life that's what I learned from movies also you got Pam Anderson oversell sheriff who takes her job way too serious and specking everybody out there doing bad things and her job is to stop everybody to see what they're doing so the sheriff kind of tells her there's a serial killer going around uh, killing random people around the country and you should be aware of what's going on. There's one scene but we'll pull a lot of red flags. Uh, she has some handyman show up. Apparently something happened to her Y5 because she can't do her business without the Y5. Turns out the handyman say, hey, uh, some creature cut the wire for the Y5. And, you know, it didn't say chew or anything, but everybody knows that, you know, animals will chew, then cut something. So that would be a major red flag right there, time to leave. There's one kind of cute scene. A best friend's cousin shows up to the cabin, and he has these different types of weed. And they decide one will smoke this one, the other will smoke this one. And they all have different reactions towards the weed. It was a good, you know, five or ten minute scene. It kind of shows the characters, uh, the way of looking at the character. That's pretty much general idea about the movie. It's one of those really cheesy movies that I used to watch in the 90s. Um, you know, they show, you know, real or little action and bite parts, you know what I mean? But there's not really gruesome about it. Um, there's some good fight scenes or nothing bloody. They don't show the person getting stabbed or anything like that. So, pretty much, you have like two hours to kill, or that's pretty much the best way to describe this movie. This movie will, will be forgotten a couple years from now. So, let me know what you think about it. Like and subscribe, and you'll do better next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.